At the Chapel of Rest in the Mallorca Hills, preparations are almost complete for Stephen Gately's body to be taken home to Ireland. Spanish police will continue their investigation of what happened here at Gately's holiday apartment, but only as a matter of procedure. And in a statement, Stephen's partner, Andrew Cowles, has appealed for an end to hurtful rumours, particularly over the role of this man, their friend, Georgi Dotchev. The continued speculation and misreporting surrounding the circumstances of Stephen's death are adding undue pressure and stress to what is already an unbearable situation for Andrew and the Gately family. Stephen and Andrew's friend, Georgia Dutchev, was staying with them at the time of the tragedy in the spare bedroom at their apartment in Port Andrax. The funeral is confirmed for Saturday, and now the pallbearers have been finalised too. The surviving members of Boyzone will carry Stephen Gately's coffin, together with two of Stephen's relatives. A private mass in Dublin on Friday night will be followed at noon on Saturday by the full funeral service here at St. Lawrence O'Toole Church, a few hundred yards from Gately's childhood home. These streets, empty now, are expected to be packed with fans and well-wishers. At his old school nearby, they still teach singing and music. He was a star schoolboy swimmer before he became a star singer. But his teachers remember a boy who loved to entertain. I had him in first class and from his earliest days he was really interested in everything artistic but especially in the performing arts and uh, like lots of children down here we deliver our curriculum through um, you know, the arts. So yes, Stephen really, really shone there. The four remaining members of Boyzone flew out to Mallorca when news of Gately's death first broke. Now they will return to the island to accompany his coffin on the flight home to Dublin. Paul Brennan, Sky News.